right. But one thing I noticed, right, in this interview is that you brought up Haitian Jack, Jimmy Henchman, and Von Zilp. These are all people that's connected to Pac in a negative way. You a Pac fan or no? I'm a Pac fan, bad boy killer. I don't know how, damn, that nigga Tupac bring a monster out of me like no other. Pac bring something out of me, I be untapped, I be like, damn, ain't no rapper really do that to me no, no more. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no rapper do that no more. I fucked it with BG. Oh, ain't no rapper do that no more, really, how Pop brought that thing up out of me, you know? You know what I'm saying? I, money bag, yo, doing it now, though, but damn. But yeah, I'm a Tupac fan, though, you know? Why you say that, though? Nah, I was just wondering how they ever spoke to you about Pop. Yeah. You know, I got a, um, I got a theory on Park, right? <laughs> Cause I was I was locked up, right? And you know, like I holler at Jack, looking at him in the eyes, drilling, looking at him deeply, like, man, what's up? What's up? Are we in Vegas? We meeting up, going to a fight, Lennox Lewis. We I'm like, man, what's up with um with Tupac, man? So uh, he tried to make it his claim to fame, but I'm meaning he get asked that a lot, you know? I'm in prison, everybody keep asking me the same shit, Lil Wayne. I'd be like, man, I made millions, dog. I'm making 20, I'm indicted for 172 million. Stop asking me about this, little man. But anyway, whatever his claim to fame is, so I'm like, what's up with Park, man? Jack? And, you know, Jack give it to me on some. Hey man, listen, we caught the little red case, whatever, the big blue. She said we did that. I'm from Brooklyn. I put him in work. Hey, she ain't coming. She ain't going to. Drop the affidavit, man. Drop the affidavit on me. Pop got to put in his own work, man. Okay? What the f I'm not putting in work for him. So. He gave it to me in that form. I respected it. Cause Haitian or not, we like, man, nigga, dog, I don't know, boy. What's up with Pac? But anyway, when he give it to me, I'm like, oh, you put in your own work. Pac ain't putting on his own work. This shit happened to him. But within that also, you know, I've been locked up. And when a dude get locked up, this when, this when, this when the grass is cut. And you get to see what life you live in. You get to see, oh, sh I see that worm, that snake, that no good auntie. Not my mama. So, you know, to me, Tupac locked up. Tupac locked up. Them people, he go there, ah, he playing the fifth. Whatever. He go you know, there, and he, them people say, all right, you look fucked up. Man, put up a million dollars and we're gonna let you out. So, main man locked up, Pop. And he about to do 11 months. But anyway, he locked up. So that means he gotta be sending his mother, hey man, I don't know what it's to be locked up with. Four albums and three movies. <laughs> and somebody say, man, put up a million and you out. So that means you send your mama over there, hey man, go holler at the Hugh brothers. Come back, mama come back three weeks. Baby, they say they looking elsewhere. Huh? Damn, go holler at Priority, man. Tell them I'll do three albums, man. Just put it up. Baby, they say they look, they come back two months later, man. Baby, they say that um, they, 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 they not trying to look that way right now. Huh? Damn, man. Holla at Jada, man. She sent you 500 commissary money. You got it? Yeah. Niggas in the dorm and inmates gonna scream. And plus New York, them Albanians, them Russians, them Italians. Yo, I wish I motherfucking had a fucking one million dollar bond. I be the fuck up out of here. Then he gotta listen to Wendy. He got ready. Seven month, eight month, nine month. They just say put a meal up. You got four movies. You got three movies and four albums out. Put the meal up.
You can't get out. I was locked up once on a Friday. My, and I'm like, the lawyer, what'd he say? Hey, yeah, yeah. They said they're going to let you out Monday. Monday? Man, get me out now. It's Friday. It's two more days. What you mean by that? What the f***? Why you want to see me here? Get me out, man. Motherfucker be worn out, man. But he about to do a little stretch and be posted up in there for 11 months. So I know he like, hey, man, that shit happened on them premises. Puff them ain't doing it. He got to listen to Hot 97. <laughs> Wendy, she go hard. <laughs> Wendy ain't sparing nobody. She ain't seen him yet. She giving it to him. And big man Suge, 11 months later, boom, 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 what? Boy, I got it. You got the meal, yeah. I ain't screaming East Coast. Let's ride. So you know, it's a lot of madness, man, that happens, man. When you clearly see your fans ain't what it is, because he had two girls was writing them. He only saw one. You know what I'm saying? Reading his, oh, I, I know I read everything about him. Being, when I'm locked up, you know what I'm saying? Like, the way he untapped my monster is amazing. You know what I'm saying? That shit is, the, damn, that, that, he's amazing at that, man. You know what I'm saying? I understand it. I used to do it to my, my dudes, like, you couldn't say I had a BMW. Or, or you say, hey, Ch Chip got a BMW. Somebody pistol whooping you. They don't be saying dude's name around here, man. You could say, that's his baby. Five. Just working dudes for me. You know, like, hey, man, chill, man, relax. Because what I, how I, I tapped them and gave them um, a, a bondage, you know what I'm saying? But, um, you know, he got out though. He let them know, boy. Fuck your bitch in the click you claim. West side. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But he did that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah.